All right, what's up everybody? Another day, another property tour. If this is your first time tuning into this channel, my name's Chuck, it's Cruiswat, and I'm with Simply Vegas, licensed real estate agent out here in Las Vegas, Nevada. So today we are here in the city of Las Vegas in a master plan community called Southern Highlands. This home is in a guard gated community. You would have to go through a guard gate and also through another gated community. This is a very exclusive neighborhood. The builder on this home right here is actually a Lennar. Now this home that we are gonna be featuring today is 6,250 square feet, five bedrooms and a den. Property does have a next gen suite too as well. So let's get right into it. Oh, real quick, the asking price on here is 4.5 million so as you can see up on the hill they are starting to trench and excavate look at that you can actually see the work vehicle all the way up there i'm not too sure what that is called but however right it's gonna have some beautiful views also real quick the uh, lots right across the street they're less than half an acre and they're going for about two million dollars so as you can see this is a nice huge lot you've got terracotta stones all the way through you do have the uh, frosted glass here all this was actually an upgrade here folks now you know with Lennar there's certain things that they um, have a standard but the owners of this property took it to a whole nother level as you can see we do have a ring doorbell you have this custom frost glass and then we have our keypad to enter now, as we come on in now we can actually see the courtyard Take a look how beautiful and how large this courtyard is. You do have a fireplace, the stack stone, and on the fireplace, you do have the option to add right here, your TV and your power outlets, okay? One thing that you're gonna notice about this home, there's a lot of windows that bring in a lot of light. Now, uh, another thing, this home was actually built in 2019. So as you can see, the design of this home now this is going to be a more of your Spanish uh, colonial style uh, exterior right however on the inside it gives you that class or clash of modern now these doors here are not the original doors these are custom pivot I'm sorry not pivot doors but French doors take a look how beautiful these doors are now as you enter through these doors you can just see how open this floor plan is there's just so much to take a look at so I just want to pre-warn you that this, win, uh, this video may be a little bit longer. However, uh, the other thing is that uh, uh, with the furniture, nothing is included, okay? But everything is negotiable. But I'm just gonna kind of walk around here, kind of get you guys' bearings. The home is actually facing west, so your sun exposure is gonna be more on the back side. But again, if you take a look, this home has so much windows that it literally brings in a lot of light. I just don't even know where to start. We're gonna start over here in the kitchen. All appliances are included in the sale of this transaction. Now we have this beautiful island and uh, on this island we have a total of two seams on this island. As you can see, these, these are quartz with a two inch face and we have a wine rack with a wine chiller. And on this upgrades here, what they did was full overlay cabinets with dovetailed self-closing cabinets and some beautiful hand pools, as you can see. And also they did the upgrades on skinning the sides here, which gives that extra custom look. But what I like about this, as large as this island is, if you noticed, we have two dishwashers here, right? And this should be an ice maker. Yep, an ice maker. Now on this one, uh, you do have the uh, undermounted dual basin sink here, and it looks like we have a RO system right here, garbage disposal. Now, uh, when it comes to the lighting, take a look at the chandelier lights, okay? These are actually custom crystal glasses, and basically the owner, that's what they do for a living, and that's the reason why these things are gorgeous, okay? Uh, the ceilings on here are 10 foot uh, high. As you can see with the cabinets, you have ample storage. 48 upper cabinets, you have the um, undermounted lights. Again, uh, full overlay cabinets. You got the double stack with the crown. Then you have your built-in refrigerator, okay? Full counter depth as well. If we look at the cabinets here, the cabinets, these are actually pot drawers, so you have some options to customize these, and that's what they did, pot drawers all the way down. 
Love the uh, beautiful backsplash too as well. And then as you can see, we have the monogram, which is the upgraded oven and the convection, okay? Six panel door that takes you into the pantry. Pantry is a full walk-in pantry. I'm not gonna get right into that, okay? Now, uh, you do have the uh, skip trawl texture. You have the half inch bull nose on here too as well. And as you can see, we got the monogram 48 inch with the six burner on here. I'm not too sure what the BTUs are on this one. And we have the hood all the way to the top. And when it comes to lighting, as you can see, this looks like uh, the lighting here is actually controlled through Wi-Fi too as well. You do have an option. But man, take a look at this. What do you think about this home, Rudy? It's gorgeous, right? 4.5, yeah, I think it's 4 and a half. John, what do you think? Yeah. Nice home, right? All right, so now coming into the dining area, the dining area is very large. Now when it comes to the dining area, I will have a link in the description below for all the dimensions. However, I can't, you know, tell you all the dimensions because I just don't, oh, here we go. 15 by 18 on the uh, dimensions. However, take a look at these chandelier lights. This thing is just gorgeous. Then we have a full built-in bar section too as well. Okay. Now attention to detail. If we take a look at the feature wall here, we have some nice, nice stonework, which is really nice. And I love these quarter turns here as well. And the home is equipped with an alarm system. Now we have a nine foot slide, low E windows on here. These are vinyl slides. On this one, I believe it's a 20 foot slide. Now coming into the main living area, this is just very large and the ceilings are super high. You do have the recess lighting too as well. As you can see the fireplace, you have stack stone all the way up to the top, which is gorgeous. Now, let's make our way down here. Okay, now this is very interesting. One thing that you're gonna notice about the rooms, all the rooms are all private, right? It's on one side or the other. We're gonna start down on this side here. Okay, so this is what's interesting about this room right here. So the first room, this is actually a suite. Now, if you notice with this suite, it does come with one thing that's very interesting, okay? But I'll get into that in just a second. We have 24 by 12 on the tile, porcelain tile, again, all the vanities are 36 inches, nice cast iron sink, full frame mirror, and we have our walk-in shower. And then we have tile cladded all the way to the top. Now what do we have over here? On this side is our walk-in closet, which is really deep. Now, let me show you what's um, very interesting about this room. I believe these are luxury uh, vinyl flooring here. Now, you see this right here, a couple things. You have the slide into your main courtyard, and then you also have a garage. If your guest comes out here, they can park in their two-car garage and they can access the property from this side. They don't have to go to the front door. You can close this off, okay? I'm gonna take you guys into the garage real quick because as you can see with these frosted glasses, believe it or not, these are about $13,000. Okay, they're not cheap. Also, flooring has been epoxied. What I like about this is you have the garage that leads to the outside. This must be extra storage. Let's see what we have here. Oh, this takes you out to the main courtyard. Nice, love that. <laughs> All right, let's head back inside of the property. Okay. Now off to the right here we have Full bathroom, again, 36 inches on the countertop. Everything is all the same. I said full bathrooms, but nope, I was wrong. This is just a quarter bath for your guests. But again, look at all the windows here. Everything is just all open. Now I'm gonna take you guys back into the next gen. Now on this next gen, there was a couple options that you could have done on this next gen. You could have built a closet, so this way it would be a room and also a living room too as well. Again, you have the beautiful chandeliers. We have 10 foot ceilings, okay? Nice and open. Now, with the next gen, because this is all part of the next gen here, what's nice about this is that you have your little kitchen area, okay? With your built-ins, which is really nice. 
You got the quartz countertops, beautiful backsplash. 42 upper cabinets, love the windows. You got the sink too as well. And also the dishwasher, but most importantly, take a look at this. This is what I love right here. So if you want to entertain, you can literally open this thing up right here. Look at this, isn't this thing gorgeous? But what we're gonna do is close this, okay? Now I'm gonna take you guys to the outside. Now, one thing I want you to take a look at is, look at the uh, transitioning on the uh, tile work. It just flows right through. You have this nice, beautiful covered patio. Oh, one thing I, I didn't notice above here, it's all cladded with vinyl, which is really nice. And take a look, we have our fireplace here. And we have a barbecue area. Now this home is huge, you don't see a pool like this. Now the lot size on this is a 23,522 square feet. Now according to the listing agent, um, this pool has a uh, certain type of chemicals. What was the name of the chemicals here? It, it was like very low or something. It was like ozone. Ozone. Or something like in the air it makes it natural. Wow, take a look at this. You can literally walk down this path and you have like a little sitting area right there, which is kind of cool. I actually like that. But here's the thing. You're not gonna buy another home in this location with something this large. There, there's just no way. All right, let's. Let's come back this way here. Well, let me know what your guys' thoughts are about this property so far. Can you see yourselves living here? Also, I wanna know what would you pay for this property? Again, I'm gonna have a link in the description below. And I'll try not to make this video too boring. All right, so we got the air conditionings over here. You got the floodlights. We're gonna head back over here. York is getting some video. Outside shower. Outside shower. Ooh, see, we didn't even talk about that. Okay, so you mentioned outside shower. Take a look at this. This actually makes perfect sense. You have a pool this big, why not have an outdoor shower? You got your gas right here. RV parking. If you had an RV, I'm not too sure, make sure to check with the uh, HOAs, okay? We got the pool pumps. As you can see, we have the Pentel, I, I believe, for the pool pump, I'm not gonna walk out there. But I do love these pop-outs right here. Also, right above, you do got the ring floodlights, it looks like on both sides, okay? You got LED lights too as well. Let me kick these rocks back here. As you can see, we have our gas stub. You can add another gas here if you choose to. Now we're gonna go back inside, okay? All right, so back here we have the uh, two-car garage. Then we're gonna head on upstairs. We got some closet space right here as well. Let's see what this uh, this looks like here, boom. All right, so you can literally fit, fit two cars in here. True two-car garage, coat closet. Now, we're gonna head up the stairs. Now, the staircase is about 48 inches. One thing I want you to take a look at is the uh, transition on here. And the agent had put this out to me. So we have the 12 by 12 on the tile with a 12 inch uh, stagger, right? 12 by 24 with a 12 inch stagger. But if you look all the way up to the stairs, the tension to detail, it lines all the way up, which I think this is the best part of the home. For me, that really piques my interest on this home. Now I do love these windows. Another thing is that, am I gassing you guys up? Yes, I am. Now, one thing I do love about this home, it's completely lived in, right? Now take a look at this. Look how gorgeous and how open this is. But now we're gonna start off on this side. Now, I'm not too sure what room this is already. I lost count, however. We have a room, closet here. I believe the floors, they feel like they're pergola. I could be wrong. You have a balcony to the front of the home, okay? Now on this one we have four can lighting, closet. <clears throat> Love the fact that we have a thermostat here, but also we have a jumper duct too as well. Coming back here. Now walking into our 
bathroom. There we go. Nice three quarter shower. And I love the fact that there's a window here that brings in a lot of light. 36 inches on the cabinets again. Full frame mirror. Now, this is interesting. You have a pocket door, which is really nice due to the fact that with these pocket doors, it just gives you more of that space. Now, we're going to walk down this hallway here. Off to the left, we have our laundry room. Now, the laundry room has a sink, front load washer and dryer. Again, we have a 24-inch depth counter space, followed up by a 36-inch uh, cabinet above with a 3-inch crown. You have an attic access. Again, you have storage on the right-hand side too as well. And coming back here, you just got ample storage. 48 inches on the smart panel box. This home is equipped with smart home technology. Again, that's something that you're gonna have to get, in, get into uh, with the agent. I'll have a link in the description below. Now walking down here, we have two bedrooms that share a Jack and Jill. These bedrooms are very large, not your standard bedroom. Okay. On this one, we have a two-can lighting. Okay. Kind of give you a better perspective. Again, we have the pergola flooring, closets right there. Coming into the bathroom. Again, nice high countertops, 36 inches. <coughs> Sorry for the cough. And off to the left, we have our tub shower combo. I'm gonna walk right through here. Now we have another bedroom that sets in the back of the house, okay? Six panel door, again, we have our jumper duct too as well. Now we're gonna come through this full balcony. Now, this full balcony also attaches to the uh, primary, okay? Which is really nice. <clears throat> Take a look at this, isn't this gorgeous? Now one thing I'm gonna show you that this home has I'm gonna head on up this spiral staircase, okay? We're gonna go up here real quick, take a look around. Ah, here we go. Now, very clean. I can tell the owner does not spend their time up here. We got LED lights, gas stub, water spigot, electrical, and cable outlet right here. But take a look at this. Look at the view. Gorgeous, right? Now, like I said, this home has been lived in. There are certain things that can be done, like paint chips, scuff marks. And that's normal for wear and tear. But now we're gonna go down this crazy spiral staircase. But man, look at that. Now you're probably wondering, okay, my backyard faces these houses. Look, the good news is this. This is in front of the house, right? People don't hang out in front of their house. They're gonna go hang out in the backyard. So you'll still have your privacy too as well. All right, let's head on back here. I'm gonna take you down this way. And we're gonna go take a look at this uh, primary down here in this catwalk. Again, you have this beautiful crystal chandelier that overlooks the front entry. Again, there's a lot of windows here, okay? I know I'm putting this out a lot, but this, this is a big deal for me. So off to the left, we got the primary. Off to the right, down this hallway, <coughs> we've got another suite here. And this is a beautiful, <coughs> excuse me, suite. You got the balcony up front, which I'm not gonna go out to the front of the balcony. I don't wanna go outside. Because we're probably like 20 minutes into this video. Some of the grout just needs to be clean. It's not a big deal. However, you should always get a home inspection, so just keep that in mind. <coughs> My throat is getting dry. Oh, take a look at this. We have another thermostat here too as well with a full rocker switch. You got six inches on the uh, baseboards. Grout lines are straight. That's a plus. All right, now let's take a look at this primary because this primary is a large primary. 
So the primary on this one, right? <clears throat> 22 by 19. So it looks like we have six can lighting, nine foot ceilings on the second floor, okay? Looks like we have our cable outlet and all that stuff here. Forgot the blinds, our electronic blinds. We have low E windows, six panel, I mean, uh, <coughs> six foot door or slider. But now let's take a look at this bathroom. This bathroom is gorgeous. We're gonna start off with the flooring. Look how beautiful this flooring is. You got the water closet, Look at that. I love this spa shower here. You have a half inch glass, and you can tell this is a Starfire glass. It's got a lot of iron in it, that's why you got that green tint. Back here, we have a full walk in closet. But most importantly, take a look at this. Washer and dryer in the primary. Isn't that gorgeous? Extra cabinet space. Now, if you guys are interested in this property, like I said, I'll have a link in the description below. If you guys wanna tie this up in escrow, the earnest money deposit $150,000, okay? Uh, HOAs here are $370 for the sub, which is this neighborhood, okay? And it looks like the master is $62 a month. So, again, I'll have a link in the description below. If you guys haven't had a chance to subscribe to this channel, I would highly recommend you subscribe to the channel. Other than that, thank you so much for tuning in. I'm Chuck, it's Chris Watt with Simply Vegas, and be blessed, folks. Did you like that video home tour? Are you a fan of this channel and you wanna get plugged into the real estate market? Well, I got something for you. We have a new channel, real estate, vlogs, Las Vegas lifestyle, behind the scenes, financing, flipping, commercial properties, interviews, local businesses, Chuckett's Crusoe 2.0, check it out.